Parkinson's disease is one of the most common human neurodegenerative diseases and many of you will know someone who has it. I'm Alison Cooper from the University of Birmingham and my interest in the brain led me to undertake some research into an aspect of the biology of Parkinson's disease. Nowadays, I mostly teach students from a whole range of backgrounds at all sorts of levels. And this multidisciplinarity is proving to be very important in helping us better understand the brain. And of course, that includes the biology of Parkinson's. Currently, there is no cure for Parkinson's disease. Individuals are affected to different degrees, although because of the progressive nature of the disease, many of them will experience a decline in their quality of life over time. Whilst this might sound rather bleak, it is important to know that there is considerable research effort going on in universities and hospitals worldwide, including here at Birmingham, to try and better understand Parkinson's disease. The ultimate aim, of course, being to prevent it, but at the very least to find better treatments for it. This course won't give you a diagnosis or a treatment plan but it aims to discuss in an accessible way what our current state of knowledge is about the underlying biology and the consequent functional disruptions that we see in Parkinson's disease. We'll then go on to touch on some of the newer lines of research that are being pursued across the world. So if you have an understanding of the fundamentals of the cells of the brain and how they communicate, perhaps from the Good Brain, Bad Brain, Basics of the Brain course, and you now want to go on to apply this information in the specific case of Parkinson's disease, then this course is for you.